affirmations. Within our journals, we can use what's called an affirmation. What are affirmations? Affirmations are positive, supportive phrases or tapes, as we talked about, uh, that we can consciously use to create better thoughts and images that we had prior to that. So we can't have fear and faith in our head at the same time. It won't work. One's going to be in the air or the other. So let's kick out fear, replace it with faith, and we'll be better for it. These affirmations are what we use for that. Now, stress. It can cause some bad thoughts, words, and actions, all right? Uh, stress can re release epinephrine, which is adrenaline in your body. Long-term, these effects uh, of these chemicals can really, they can kill you. They're, they're horrible. Affirmations also release chemicals. These are good chemicals. These are chemicals like... Um, Oxytocin, uh, which creates a feeling of trust and attachment. Cortisol, which makes a feeling of like, excitement. Uh, serotonin, which is the happy chemical, makes you happy. Uh, you know, when we make these affirmations, our, our body reacts to those affirmations and releases these chemical exchanges, which are fantastic. And, and so we can literally control how we feel through these chemical releases by the words and thoughts that we have. Now, it's best if you affirm these things out loud so that the thoughts become your words and then become your actions. And so this is pretty interesting. Now, something I find really interesting that the word, the reverse order of thoughts and words and actions can, can take place as well. We can take a positive, positive physical action and it'll, it will affect our words and our thoughts. So we can say a word and make our thoughts believe what we're saying. Make it opposite. So that's so. Let, let me give you an example. If a single guy is sitting at a coffee shop and he had a bad day, he's feeling sorry for himself. Maybe he's looking for his job, uh, and suddenly this beautiful woman looks over at him and smiles and says, "Hi, how are you?" To him, and you know what's he going to do? Well, first of all, he sits up, pushes his chest out, smiles, and says, "Hi, I'm I'm great. How are you? Very nice to meet you." Now, what he did was he physically displayed his best side to her first. And then he came up with positive words. He said, I'm great. I was feeling like crap a minute ago, but right now I'm great because <laughs> I changed my mind about how I feel. You said, uh, you've all experienced this. You all have. Okay. Uh, somebody gives you and comes in, makes a big surprise, or it's a surprise party. You work all down, and suddenly all your friends are there, you know, to surprise you. It can be anything like that. And you change in a minute. Okay. So these, these physical, Actions and the affirmations that we cause can all take control of that, which will make our thoughts improved. You know, so our thoughts become our words, our words become our actions. But the reverse is true too. Start doing actions; those will become our words, those will become our thoughts, and that makes a difference as well. Now, the best athletes in the world know all about affirmations. This is a tool that they use for performance because it works. This is a winning tool. This is why I want you to use these tools in your job search because it will make a difference for you. Uh, some examples of affirmations, for instance, uh, they should be present tense. They should be supportive and positive. They should be realistic. Uh, start with an I am statement is, is one of the best things you can do. So I am ready to find my new job. I am ready to tell people how I can help them. I have a great skill set. People recognize my talents. I learn skills quickly. These are all great little affirmations you can write down in your journal and then repeat them on a regular basis. You can actually buy tapes and uh, or like books on books on tape which have just a constant rolling stream of these tapes that you can input uh, as well. Listen to them and help you know keep you pumped up. Uh, music is a great tool for that as well. Um, let me give a, a more specific affirmation where you take in, you put a little more detail, which I like even better. I'm making great progress in my job search this week by calling at least five people a day in my network. Now that's action. Okay. So you're talking about these real actions that you're going to take. That's a, that's a fantastic thing to do. So let's try working with these affirmations, put them in your journal. Let's get some affirmations going, be listening to these things, be saying these things on a regular basis, and it'll make a huge difference for your mindset.